Anyways, uh, so getting straight into this, we have Shakezula versus AI, Jake versus Mark. Also, let me know if the uh, commentary and game volume are a bit better now. Anyways, let's see. Just starting off, getting some solid damage here. Uh, I feel like Mark has a little bit of a tough time killing Jigs because she dies a lot easier up, and Mark just doesn't kill up all that well. Yeah. Also, I'm not sure about how AI does with Jigs. Jigs is like starting to become like one of our top melee players. Yeah, definitely. I believe he got first. He either got first or second. Uh, the last time he showed up. Well, apparently game volume is too loud still, so I'll turn that down a little bit more. I don't even know how to mod from the mobile site. Alright, let me know if that's better game volume wise. And with that, there goes Mark's first dog. Yeah, um, edge guarding is definitely something really good for Jigs in this matchup. Because Marth, he doesn't have, like, a bad recovery, per se. He just but kind of struggles. Yeah, it, it's very linear, and if you disrupt it, then he's just kind of screwed. Oh, I think, I think that was a tipper. Yeah, he was, like, the little part of the arc. Yeah. Just managed to hit the tip. And with that, honestly, this isn't that far a part of a game anymore. Yeah, AI is definitely keeping it close. Good spot dodge on that grab there. <laughs> okay. I like the mix-up of just Dancing Blade 1 every once in a while. Oh, yeah, but he didn't have his jump there. Yeah. Fortunately, yes, he did. Pounds him right out of his approach. Pounds him really good. Move. It is. It lasts for so long, too. Yeah, it's also really good for recovery. Yeah. Dash attack pushes him off the ledge there. It doesn't really get that much out of it, though. Yeah. AI seems to be struggling right now. He really needs to get this kill off. Yeah, because he's already at kill percent himself on his next stock. Alright, alright, that works. Yep. At least get a little bit of damage. Ooh. But yeah, forward smash, not even remotely safe on shield. Especially not against someone with that airspeed. Yep. And with the taunt. Yep. So, this looking like a much stronger showing from Shake Zula than the first stock was. Yeah. Oh, okay. Gets with the tip. Tip. Yep, didn't quite snap to the ledge quick enough. He just dies for it. That's the cool thing about Marth, though, is right. just if you make a small mistake anywhere within the range of his sword, which is, as we all know, massive, yeah. you just kind of die. Yeah, Marth's really good with that sort of thing. His problem really comes from getting his attacks baited out, though, because a lot of them aren't safe on whiff. They're pretty big commitments. Right. Get, oh, okay. And with that, AI is right back in this game. All right, he like, can bring this back. That was a beautiful conversion. That was a really good down air. Yeah. Oh, oh. going for the super risky counter. Right. Didn't actually get punished for it either, though. Right. Over Shake Zula, not looking like he wants to lose this first game. He hasn't been hit yet on the stock. Yeah. Alright. Oh, gets now forward smash. Oh, yeah, yeah that's a dead. That's, that's a dead line. Without his double jump, Marth just doesn't really have a recovery. Yeah. Good job to AI managing to bring it back. Almost. Yeah. Also here, really quick. Richard, go ahead and report uh, a match loss for Jesse. Alright, we have someone who showed up and signed up and is gone. So we had to DQ them. But anyways, uh, looks like we're going to Pokemon Stadium. Greatest 
and oh, Sheik. Sheik yep, Sheik versus Marth. Um, I haven't actually seen many Sheiks or Marths pick this stage, so I'm kind of surprised. I've always seen this yeah. cited as like a spacey stage. Yeah, I agree. Not quite sure who has the better matchup on this stage. Um, it might be something along the lines of FD was banned, and so Shake just went, well, I mean, this is sort of like FD. I can chain grab pretty similarly, but I yeah. don't know. I'd rather do this stage than FD. Mm -hmm. I don't like FD. Yeah, it's a very polarizing stage. If you have any sort of, like, chain grab, it's just, oh, well, that's game. <laughs> yep. Alright, so he goes for the wave dash back, forward smash, but doesn't slide back far enough, I guess. Made it to it too late. Good back air there. Oh, oh he okay. SD'd. Yeah, going for the Shino stall. I'm not sure if he just missed the ledge or grabbed the ledge and then, like, fast fell. Because that's what it looked like to me, yeah. but... Ooh, crouch cancel down smash. Puts him off stage. And that that's down gonna smash... Kill. Yeah. Semi spikes just kind of wreck Marth. Yeah. Good fair to grab. Oh, got oh. the tipper. Oh. Oh, not quite. Gets hit by the explosion. That was. He didn't quite convert it, but that was actually pretty neat. Right. He got the like falling up air into something. Now he's switching to Zelda. Managed to make it back, but at what cost? Get... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this... Well. Man, it's like I'm watching uh, Falco Edgeguard. It's just like, oh, so I grab the ledge, and then if you don't go for the ledge, I just get up and forward smash you. Yep. Only in this case, back throw, but still. Oh, oh Shig Zula has actually been doing really well, except when he's on the ledge like that. Yeah, that's. He's got a long way to go if he's gonna. Pick gonna try to win this game. Yeah, he definitely does. Not really a place you want to be in. Yeah. Plus, I think, in my opinion, Mark beats Sheik. Alright. I don't know. I know that it's a pretty tough matchup for both characters. Yeah. So, if nothing else, I could definitely see, like, right around even. Right. But I think Marth does have the range advantage, and yeah. I can mean a lot in a match like this. Sheik's edge guarding might push it over the edge, but I don't know. Yeah, it's true. It's, I guess the I, only reason I think it's a better matchup for Marth is because of the range. Yeah. And I know that um, I've, I don't play Melee super seriously. Like, I don't no cancel wave dash, stuff like that. But I've played both Sheik and Marth, and I know that I hate fighting Sheik with Marth more than I hated fighting Marth with Sheik. <laughs> but, I mean, I'm not sure how much my opinion on that actually matters. Right. Anyways, looks like we're finally getting back into the match. No more Pokemon Stadium stuff. Alright, Shigzula knowing to jump out rather than get hit by that back air now. Good adaption. Ooh, ooh, nice grab. Yeah, that was very well timed. Dash attack forward air. No, no kill, but. Alright, I wonder if he was actually trying to do that or if that was. Like. Actually, no. Melee, that couldn't have been a down smash attempt. Never mind. Crouch cancel to down smash. Crouch canceling against Marth seems super good. Because a lot of moves you can do out of it have range that can challenge yeah. Marth's stuff. And that's his main advantage, right? Alright, it's down to last stock again. Oh! Yes, dude. Wow, three stocks to that. That is truly unfortunate. Yeah, that. Oh, man. Yeah, that is not a way you want to go out. Alright, well, let's see if he sticks with Sheik and just tries to focus a little bit more on, you know, staying on the ledge rather than off it. Right. Or goes back to Jigs. I think he's probably going to go back to uh, Yeah, that, that's what I'd expect to see. Also, I need to change the game volume here, too. Dang. That is pretty loud. Is 
seems like, yep, this is I expected. Yeah. I know that Jigs is his main, so especially when you're right. like going into a like match defining set, you kinda wanna go your main. But <laughs> switching this tag back on here. Going level ten. Shoutouts to level ten Metapod in the chat. I just realized that. At level ten, level ten. Yeah. Okay, so game three. Um I don't know where we're gonna go. I'm assuming that Dreamland got banned. Yeah. Like at least or like, apparently it didn't. Okay, well, that's definitely something you want to ban here. Yeah. Or maybe he decided he needed to ban uh, Final Destination, because otherwise he could just get chain grab across right. it. Uh, I'm not actually sure quite how well Sheik's chain grab works on Marth, but I'm pretty sure it's at least, yeah. like, solid. But yeah, like, on any other stage, that would have been a stock right there. Yeah. Dash attack, Mars off stage, and uh, no, he'll make it back make though. It. Ooh, all right, good mix up there, going for the ledge rather than anything more punishable. Oh, oh. catches him out of the air, but again, any other stage that would have been a kill. Yep. That's why the stage is so good for Jigs, because it just kind of lessens her main weakness. This stage is pretty much a bloody stage. Yeah. And it also, it doesn't really hurt her because she lives for a lot longer, so there yeah. goes her weakness. But her kill moves are so strong, it doesn't even matter. Just, yeah. You get rested, it was like, oh, you need an extra, like, 4% or something. Yeah. There we go. It's not buzzing anymore. Spot dodge is the forward smash. Doesn't actually really get a conversion off of it. Still. Avoid the damage. I'm pretty sure that would have killed at this point. Still Order, kill. no kill. Dang! Dang. Oh wow, my god. Wow, Jigs just living. Jigs looking away as much as Bowser out here. <laughs> like, apparently. So that... No, oh that's still my god. Kill. 179 Jiggly. I mean, honestly, though, Marth isn't doing too bad damage wise, considering yeah. how much trouble he's having. Right, trying to kill the dog. Stock. Okay, that'll that's finally kill. kill. 197%. Almost yeah. 200. <laughs> that is insane. But like that, he's almost caught back up already. Yeah, AI is managing to keep this pretty close. Uh-oh, he's offstage without a jump right now, oh, though. And the roll get yeah. up, there's the stock. Percent doesn't matter if Jigs can get you offstage like that. Yep. Yeah. Just wave dashing back a ton. Yeah. Jigs wave dash just looks hilarious. Uh, good spacing there on the wave dash because the duck that Marth does actually managed to go under Jake's bear and then that set up for the forward smash that he got. Alright, nice. Uh, Jake didn't let oh. snap well enough. I think he still had his jump, but either yeah. way, he managed to make that or make it back without having to be right. having to use it. Ooh, ooh, hits the light shield there. Roll out to come back. Mm. Um, if AI had seen, oh, oh. just oh. scoops him out of the air right there. But if uh, AI had seen that, I think he could have actually just countered it. And yeah. That probably would have been a dead Jigs. Oh, okay. 
forward smash will kill. Man, that, I think that that forward smash just killed Marth at a lower percent than Tipper forward smash does to wow. Jigs on this stage. Wow. This is Marth's worst stage, though. Yeah, on top of it being Jigs' best. Yeah. Oh, oh crouch rest. to rest. Oh, wow. my God. I, I did not know that was a thing. Yeah, um, Marth's so tall that Jigs can just crouch under his grab.